Hello there. In PCB editor, it is now possible to version control boards. To enable version control, then navigate to Setup and select User Preferences. Under On Support, simply set a check mark at Allegro Pulse Enable. On the file, there are now three new menu items. First, you need to copy your board to create a version control board in your repository. With this board, it is possible to handle multiple versions of your board using commit. Commit creates a new version of the board which you are working on. Here you need to provide a comment. And in this case, my board is not routed yet and therefore I make a tag called unrouted and select OK when you written a comment to the commit. From file, select version control. And here I can see all the versions in my repository. At this point, I only have version 1.0, which was the commit that I just created. On the right side, you can see a preview of the board, which is actually a PDF that is generated whenever you commit. I could, for example, now insert all the essential routing on the board and then create a new commit. So now I created a commit that contains all the essential routing and I contain a commit that contains non-routing. So here we can see the difference between the two commits by the preview in the right side. The last thing I will create in this example is the shapes that we have to create on the board. So firstly I insert the shapes and after this I will commit this and create a tag containing shapes and also a comment to the commit. In version control, we can now see three different commits. The first one contains no routing and just has all the placement. The second one contains all the essential routing. And the third one contains all the shapes. It is also possible to roll back to an earlier version of the board. Simply right click on the version you want to roll back on and select rollback. You will then get a warning that says if you want to copy the board before you create a rollback. Select yes to copy the board and select no if you don't want to copy the board. If I for example want to redo the shapes or the shapes was created incorrectly, I could then redo the shapes simply by rollbacking. So as you see, we don't have any shapes on the board anymore because we roll back to an earlier version. So now I could, for example, create a new shape and then I will create a new commit, which I will just call shape v2, like that. So in the version control, you can now see that I have created a, a new version of the board. You can also see that I still have the earlier version, which was 1.2 with the different shape. But in 1.3, I, I have the newly created commit. So that is how version control works in PCB editor. If you're interested in more ORCAD and Allegro videos, then subscribe to our YouTube channel where we upload videos continuously. Thank you for watching.